Hi everybody, welcome for poster number 615. Today we are September 6, 2020 and I use the gray brand to design today's poster. I made um, a mini series into the mini series um, mental process and I'm exploring uh, a new style, relatively minimalist, with typography and uh, and his brain, with uh, Japanese uh, types too. And I am continuing to explore this way to create the poster. Let's center the brain on the canvas. I already imported the fonts from uh, yesterday's poster. So here it is. Let's type the wall type title. So it is mental process number 14. Oh, number 14. I want the bigger tracking. Yeah, 240 looks okay. And, 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 man. Brock says 14 there and there I like when they are leaving the canvas very much oh, it was in the center of the canvas um today let's use a green color to set geometric shapes around the canvas and let's take your bright green up oh, here 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 yeah looks okay So let's draw some some shape here and here. And uh, select the gray, light gray color to oh, cancel, pomzi, command and select the light gray color and place it in the center. Let's draw larger shapes, different place here. Hey, Yeah, yeah, I will maybe re rework. Oh, I said maybe again. I will probably rework on the on 
on the those rectangles so for now play with the type the Japanese type that means Apollo in Japanese yeah um, the font in Japanese really brings something uh, something nice to the poster with all of this line will go a bit everywhere it's really beautiful it's really attractive um, let's type the title Okay. Everything was in the folder. I didn't carefully make it. So here is a bit better. Let's go back to put that into the folder and continue. Select the brain because it's not in the, at the right place now. Put it there. Uh, the rectangle should be above. Let's uh, set it in black color. Or maybe not. I will see that. Um, mental process fourteen. Place it in the center of this rectangle. Okay, that's not the font I want. I want the core and G sent five core so D seventy five extra bold regular mental process let's center everything let's add a stroke to this rectangle a wide stroke with a secure secure stroke like 29 29 let looks what happens and I notice the font is set in a light gray color. That's not what I want. So let's use the white color. A. Yeah, that's white now. Maybe the tracking is too large. mental process looks okay let's center one more time everything and i want to duplicate the font there and place it behind the rectangle to see what happens one more time there does it look interesting? Looks weird, that's fine. But does it look good? Mental process. Yeah, that's okay. Yeah, yeah. 
that's fine. So let's continue to add some stuff. Uh, maybe I should work a little bit on the on the brain there and intensify its shadows and lights in a way or another. Yeah, it looks better, so merge the two layers together. Duplicate the brain. Make a smaller brain there. A bigger one on the top of the canvas, like this. The smaller one, yeah, the same size, but on the bottom. Okay, a little bit bigger. Let's place it behind the rectangles, the light gray rectangles. Mm, yeah, looks good. Up behind all the rectangles. And it looks okay. It looks fine. Let's play a little bit with that brain there and copy and paste some part of its shape right there. And continue a little bit in the bottom, make it whirl. Command C, Command V, yeah, like this. It looks dynamic and it looks fine like that. Uh, last time I wrote something like uh, cognitive reserves, cognitive. Let's use a type, a color for this type. Uh, uh, what kind of color? Maybe a green. Ah, it's very light. It's too dark. Yeah. Oh, it's not mesh. Cog. <sighs> Cognitive, yeah, set the tracking higher. Cognitive. Resources. Resources. Like this. Let's make this rectangle continue the Japanese font there. Yeah. Like this looks perfect. And maybe 
maybe add a oh, not the circle but the square there fill in the light, bright uh, gray co green color set it with a blend mode blending mode something like uh, oh difference looks good colors nice color burn looks pretty well too much the color was fine color is fine just find the Uh, yeah, I don't need a lot of things for make it look good. It's, uh, it's already fine like that. Uh, let's uh, cut into the into the sh the brain with a white uh, with white color there. Let's apply it only inside the brain. Maybe it should come around there. Yeah. Like this. Duplicate it. And place it somewhere like here. Yeah, it looks okay. Let's select this copy paste and see what I can do with this shape yeah let's place it up fine let's do the same with that shape here pretty fine yeah I mean, yeah yeah i think it looks good and because i don't have a lot of time today i think i will stop now yeah it was a fast uh, it was a fast design and uh, it looks good i am i am a, a fan of the of the title in the f in the center with uh with yeah not a background uh, with a, a rectangle behind uh, i already did that for a poster long ago but uh, at that time i use uh, uh, not an expanded uh, a small typeface with a high uh, i uh, yeah it was bigger it was uh, higher uh, how to call it it was a compressed version of the font I usually use and uh, that created an, a good effect and uh, I am relatively no I am happy with the font now uh, same if I am not a huge fan of the M letter uh, the, the font looks well and the uh, Chinese type uh, it's a good font uh, pairing I think according to me to my eyes uh, it looks good I uh, pretty like it so uh, thank you to follow this fast uh, tutorial today I know uh, I maybe don't uh, really teach you the greatest technique in the world uh, I am always in a, in a big rush to to make the poster and uh, yeah graphic design it's not about the skills you know from the software it's really with the ID you come up with that uh, it is uh, important and the graphic skills uh, you can uh, learn them 
uh, about software. You can learn them everywhere, everywhere you want, anytime. And uh, it's not because you know Photoshop from A to Z that uh, you are a good graphic designer. Um, that's uh, that's good to know, really. Of course, uh, you you have to know the basics, and if you know some techniques, it's up to you. Uh, that can expand expand your vision about uh, what you can do and uh, maybe bring you ID IDs. But uh, you can do something who looks pretty with no meaning behind, and maybe the people will like. But if you do something pretty with a good ID behind and conceptual. Um, people will uh, really uh, remember and it will uh, longer last time in their in their mind and that's what uh, that's what you that's your goal that's where you want to go so i thank you to follow this, to follow today's poster take good care and uh, see you tomorrow for the, the poster 616 goodbye